uh, where have you been uh, so far? Because I know that your life is very, uh, pretty sporty and, and, and so on. Where have you uh, traveled uh, in, in, within, within this Pocopia uh, region? I mean, along the Colpa. Along the Colpa. Um, well, we've done some of the walks. The, um, they, they have a walk, a lot of organized walks. Um, the Jupancicheva pot goes, that goes from Dragatush to Vinit. So we've um, done that one. We've done um, a lot walks along by the river. Damil. Damil to Cot. Um, yeah. We know quite a few places um, where we run. And we went to Preloka for a walk. Preloka. Mm. Um, we did a race down the far end of the Colpo near Costel to Dol. Uh, there's a race along the Colpo there, 14 kilometer race, we've mm -hmm. done that. Mm -hmm. And then of course we've been the other way um, to Podzemel and um, what's that other, where they had the... Primostek. Primostek as well. So we've, mm -hmm. we've been to several places along the, the, the Colpo. Um, we have, we have friends as well who have a house, uh, English friends who come to Um, their house in Junichi, so we know. So it's near the Culpa there again, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. So yeah, we've we've seen a lot. Lots of parts of the Culpa. <laughs> a lot of the Culpa, yeah. And what about Mirnagora? Yes, we've been up we've to Mirnagora. We've been to Mirnagora. Yeah. yeah, we've walked up there. We haven't run up there yet. No, there I haven't done a race. There is a race. There is a race. Yeah. Um, There's a cycle ride. That's what you but we've that been um, we've been to Gache. They, they have a race. They have a race at Gache. Mm -hmm. Which do you know, Gache? It's, no, 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 it's no. the skiing place it's it's near Mirnagora. Uh -huh. Yeah, I, I have already heard of it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, they have a race there, and we we've raced there a few a few times now. Mm -hmm. um, But yeah, we we've been. To, um, we also belong to the um, Planinsko Drusvo, the mountaineering club, mm -hmm. and they have they've had some um, walks in the area um, up to Schmuck. We've been up to Schmuck. You know Schmuck. Above Belakrina, yeah. well, above the, the Semich. They, they do the paragliding. They do the paragliding from there. Oh, as I have already heard of uh, Smoke, yeah. uh, but I, I know I have explored uh, really small part of the possibilities mm -hmm. so far. I know, mm -hmm. but there will be a spring and mm -hmm. summer, and there will be a, a lot of possibilities. And I'm looking forward to this period. Yeah. We we've also been up to Tordinovur where they have the the mast. Isn't that Belakrina? No, I thought it was. No, it's Delenska. Oh, it's Delenska. Yeah. <laughs> This is not so far. <laughs> not so far. <laughs> yeah, Gabre um, and a place called Gospodica. Gospodica. Yeah, Gospodica. Oh, Gospodica. Yeah, um, that's up near. Um, you, you go from Gabre, don't you? Up. Yeah. It's near Tabdinov. And then you go up to Tidonova. But um, we also have races in that area running mm. up the mountain. Up mountains, yeah. Um, so, yeah, we, we've, um, we, we've seen quite a lot of Belakrina. Um, obviously, Metlika, the museum there is... Firefighter really Museum. Very, very Sorry? good. Firefighter Museum. Yes, we've yeah, been we've to seen to that. Yeah, but the to, museum yeah. in the Grad is really yeah, it's very interesting. Very very interesting kind of museum. And very Our informative. friends find it very interesting as well when they've been there. Yeah, we take them there mm -hmm. and it's very informative about, you know, the history of Belakrina. Mm -hmm. I think it's most probably um, a more interesting museum than the Delenska Museum in uh, Novo Mesto myself. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, So we've been to quite a few places. Um, we've been to a little village called Gritch, to the ice cave there, where, um, was it three years ago? We, yes. we walked up through uh, yeah, four. They have a night walk there that takes you, and you they, they, you go with um, these butler, the torches, the flaming, flaming torches. Flaming torches. Mm -hmm. And then you go, go up to through the, the forest. And through and the, the snow, it was. Through the snow, the snow was quite deep. Um, and then you come to this cave and the interesting thing is it has stalagmites and stalactites but they're made of ice, <laughs> it's not of limestone. Well, it's well known, but I not of think, um, maybe calcite. I think probably this year not quite so much because of the, we haven't had quite so much ice. But um, And they have a concert that they organise there as well which we haven't been to but it's, it's, some friends said it's very good. The cave is not particularly deep, about 200 metres maybe. But it's very steep when you go in, 
and it, it, it's fascinating with the mm -hmm. with, with the, the ice um, crystals. Yeah. And okay. No, go ahead. Uh, what's your favorite place? You you have already listed a, lo a lot of possibilities. What uh, you have already uh, vi uh, tried? What's your favorite uh, places? In in Bella in, Bal in Bella Crane or, or, or along along the Kualpa River. Yeah. Maybe the, the um, down to Jaga and Dole. Mm. We like it down there. Um, there's a very nice fish restaurant there, which does the nicest fish. Um, <laughs> At a, a village called Pr Prelesia, isn't it? Prelesia, yeah. Yeah, Prelesia. Um, yeah. Um, um, we we always go down there. It's very um, nice. It is very nice. It's very there. nice. Yeah. yeah, very nice. Yeah. We actually one year went rafting down there. Mm. And, yes. And um, when we um, one year when I was with my um, son and his family, we were driving down from Starry Turk down to towards Dol. And we met, came across three bears on the road, <laughs> walking down the road. So that was, I think, that was probably one of the highlights of their visit, <laughs> was this encounter with three bears. Because a lot of people don't even. I've uh, never seen bears. a bear. Yeah. You have. You have seen bears. She's them, seen yeah. three. Yeah. I, I wasn't there. there, but we have. We've had them in the village here the over village. the years. They come into the village. They kill the sheep. So that's how they know, or they eat the corn. Yeah. It is really interesting because it is a kind of miracle or seeing a, see, seeing a bear amazing. here. Absolutely yeah. amazing, yeah, yeah. I've never seen a bear in my life, yeah, yeah. but I have already seen it on, in pictures, but not, not in the real life. By, um, on, the way... on the way to Vlivlitsa, there's a, um, a, a place where you can actually they have two bears in captivity there. So if you wanted to go and see them, that's... Um... I think they were found orphaned when they were young. And somebody took them, and now they're in sort of big, big, big cages. Big ca they? very big cages. But, but so they're very you, big. It's quite good if you want to go and see what they look like without actually having an encounter. And you wouldn't, you wouldn't want to meet one. They're very big. <laughs> yeah. But they say in in the um, the other side of the valley here, there's volk up in the in the woods there. Wood, wolves. Uh, uh, oh, wolves. Yeah, wolves. Um, mm -hmm. up, up there, uh, as well as bears, because there's always sign of bears. Um, another so. of our favourite places is going up to Siniva, isn't it? That's yeah, nice Siniva. It's a nice village, it's quite high, beautiful views. We have a friend who has a, a, a weekend house there. Mm -hmm. and, and there's uh, some fantastic views that the drive along um, the top of the ridge there, going, you, you can see a fantastic view of. Um, Croatia, really. Croatia, yeah. yeah. And lots, you can see a long, long way. You can see the motorway. <laughs> Interesting. And if, if, <laughs> In you, the if you go on that back road to Stari Turk, that's a very nice run. Yeah. Because it, it literally goes along the side of the mountains mm -hmm. and you look across the Kolpa and you can see um, Havashka, the other side. So um, it's, um, mm. we, we like that as well, mm. don't we, there? Yeah. Mm -hmm. so. And uh, what's your favorite wine? Because there are uh, several. It is wine producing uh, yeah. part. I'm afraid my no. husband cannot say anything about wine no, because he I doesn't bet. drink was... wine. Um, but my favorite, my favorite mm -hmm. wine is um, Rumeni Muscat. I like mm -hmm. Rumeni Muscat, a, sort of a, a Swedish wine. I'd say that that's my favorite one from Belgium. I was going to use my slogan. Going to say Nicoli ne PM alcohola. <laughs> <laughs> That's correct. 